What's going on you guys? Uh, I'm going to do a video for you here using the ZVS setup but I have a different capacitor on it because I'm using the microwave capacitor to uh, blow some stuff up with. So on this video safety glasses uh, are completely necessary and I have them on right now. See? Um, so let me get some things hooked up to here. So I got this little disc capacitor hooked up now I'm going to turn the variac on and charge up the microwave capacitor. On. When the arc dies down, that means the capacitor charge is charged. So let's blow this thing up. That was uh, pretty loud there. That discharged the capacitor completely. I don't know if you saw that that well. Alright, let's blow something else up. Okay, so there's a slightly larger disc capacitor. I'm now wearing hearing protection because this is just too loud for me. Setup's on. Caps charged. And I'm going to take a step back and no more capacitor. <laughs> um, let's find maybe one more thing. This is a 33K resistor. I don't know if this will go, but it's worth a try. Here we go. Caps charged. Set the high voltage aside and. Huh. Messed up the resistor there. Okay. okay. Okay, guys, this might be the grand finale or an epic fail. So, it's a much bigger capacitor. So, let's turn on the Variac. Power's on. I have it tied to the end of a broomstick this time because I'm a little bit scared. Caps charged. And nothing. Let's try that again. Okay. Nope. Just doesn't want to do anything. Okay. That's a good enough video for y'all. And always discharge the whole setup. That's a computer monitor flyback so I you know have to discharge that. Alright, see you guys later.